I had was about whether um, China and Russia, or either one, should be considered an evil regime. President Reagan described the Soviet Union as the locus of evil in the modern world. George W. Bush referred to an axis of evil after 9-11. If you have governments that are running concentration camps or launching unprovoked wars where hundreds of thousands of people are being killed and the President of the United States calls the leader of that regime a war criminal, I don't see what it is that prohibits you from calling a spade a spade and saying these are evil regimes, which you refused to do in our earlier call. Well, I appreciate your advice on, on, on policy, and, uh, and I'll take that back, James. But uh, the president's never been one. Question. The president, no, no, why, no, why no. Why would you consider not, these evil it's regimes? Not a, it's not a simple question, James. It's a, it's a criticism that you're posing as a question. You'd like to see us uh, put a label on, on these two countries, and the President Biden just doesn't conduct foreign policy that way. I think go look at the national security strategy. Go look at the national defense strategy. Take a look at anything that the president has said over uh, his time as commander in chief about Russia and China, and you'll, and you'll see that we are speaking pretty plainly to the American people and to those countries and those leaders uh, about how we view these, uh, uh, their behavior, their conduct on the world stage, and our relationships with them. We've been very, very honest about that.